Hi everyone, uh, it's Jaden. Uh, this is another video with Nathan from Drawfee. Hi! Woo! You haven't seen him on my channel yet, but we are doing videos anyway. <laughs> what an introduction. So what we're gonna do is draw Yu-Gi-Oh characters. I don't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh. Nathan said that he knew a little bit, so hopefully we won't butcher them too much. I have this list of some characters and we don't know what they look like. We just have the names. We'll get revealed what they look like after we draw. So this is just gonna be a train wreck. Should we get started? I'm excited. Let's do it. So your monster guy is Kiribo. Kuribo. Kuribo. I kind of... Yeah. What I remember is Kuribo is sort of just like a big fluff ball. Like I've walked into friends watching Yu-Gi-Oh before. <laughs> they, like, they were always like, no, uh, it was just uh <laughs> They were saying that there was like some annoying monsters. Was this one of the like annoying guys? Because they don't seem like a monster. They just seem like a little flea. Like I'm a Pokemon person. Oh, same. So, yeah. To me, it just looks like Venomoth. You know, I might have just drawn Venomoth. <laughs> this is my version. This is my career. Kribo OC. Kribo OC. <laughs> Do not steal. He looks like he was born in the cold snow, but he wants to move to the city and pursue <laughs> like a bakery. Maybe this Kribo is, he's a baker, so he's got a chef's hat. He doesn't want to be a dual monster. He wants to be a pastry guy. He wants to make those little cupcakes. So I'm gonna reveal a clue that I have been provided. Oh, okay. This monster looks cute, but has the power to multiply infinitely. Oh. He's He doesn't need any employees. He just needs himself. Right. So so we've got Karibo Prime over here. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> they don't all get to wear the chef's hat. I mean, working that. in the culinary industry, they've got to uh -huh. have some crazy hairnets. Oh, <laughs> yeah. They, you have to sign a waiver to not <laughs> be mad if there's uh, hair in your cupcakes. You can't sue them. Since they're deadly monsters, I wonder if their hair is poison. Oh, maybe. That'd be bad for business. <laughs> it's like an assassination bakery. Oh, yeah. Bring your targets there. Yeah, you have the option. You can get a normal cupcake or an assassination cupcake. It is called assassination cupcake, so it's... <laughs> it's on the menu. It's highlighted red. There's no way to stop all that hair. Man, the janitor's probably got either a good wage or a bad life. I would not want to clone myself to be an employee because I know how lazy I am. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I wouldn't even be able to get mad at myself. I'd be like, you knew what you were getting into. And you're like, yeah, you Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all these cupcake mans. This one's doing a jump. He's like the sign twirler outside. Oh, Oh yeah, come on, get assassinated at Yay. assassination cupcakes. <laughs> it's high demand, unfortunately. <laughs> I don't know what they look like anyway, so I'm just like, yeah, you nailed it. Oh, that's actually really close. Yeah, I got pretty close. He's got very sharp claws and he's got little Pac-Man eyes. I mean, your cupcake men's probably filed themselves down so they don't stab any cupcakes. As you've already established, you don't know any Yu-Gi-Oh monsters. Yep, I know uh, nothing. Miscellaneousaurus. Miscellaneous. Thesaurus. That's why I, I okay. He's got of course we gotta go with the long neck guy. But the you know, thing you've is got... he has scissors as a head. Because um, those are random, right? How do scissors work? Shoot. So uh, clip. no. Vertically. Nope, nope. There we go. <laughs> yeah! So this is the face. You've set off on a very good path already. <laughs> oh, they're the, they're the eyes! There we go. <laughs> if I saw this <laughs> coming towards me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Obviously, we're on the right path. I just read what the first clue was, and it's very good. Just mix a bunch of dinosaurs together. Oh, okay. It's like <laughs> those three-headed dinosaurs, and they're like, there's yeah. that one brother that just you deal with. So so there's actual dinosaur face, and then there's also scissor face. They don't get along. You know, I just want to be able to enjoy some construction paper without having you snip it. He's like <laughs> trying to sleep, and then he just wakes up to snip, 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 sn
what can we do for wings? Maybe that's the construction paper. It's been yeah. cut up. He cut his own wings on and there. And then the other one's just like snippy. No, it's yeah, like one just... of those, those paper guys. I couldn't find another place for his uh, paper guy wings. So, so it, it replaced them. That's good. It's yeah. an upgrade. You know, they don't fly real good, but they're, they're mostly for show. And then like he leaves a little trail of nails. Oh, that's got to be painful coming out. <laughs> no, no, uh, his tail thing, he hammers things. Okay, because when you said he leaves a trail, I was yeah, he's my mind my mind went to oh, okay good that's from his pocket that's much better <laughs> than what I was thinking either way it's probably both I don't know Yu Gi Oh they probably explain it in the anime yeah this is oh my oh, head I mean, with I the got hammer the head right one of the heads right that must be like his dad or something <laughs> you two better get along I will turn this card around so how hungry are you uh it is I'm sort of bleeding into my lunchtime right now how about uh, hungry burger. How about a? That's not the monster's name, is it? Oh yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! People complain that Pokemon is unoriginal. Hungry burger. I know there's a there's a Yu-Gi-Oh monster named like Mystic Tomato. Mystic. So. Oh, the, they're the perfect pair. Unless your enemy doesn't like tomato on their burger. I do not like tomato personally. So uh, that like minus a thousand life points for you. Maybe this burger's got teeth. What goes on a burger? Some pickles? Pickles. I think of that SpongeBob episode with that one big flounder fish. He's like, you forgot the pickles. And SpongeBob's like, it's under your tongue. And everyone's like, oh. <gasps> What a reveal. I'm not talking about it all. Um, I mean, that's not, I, I know SpongeBob works at a, a fast food burger restaurant. What should the eyes be? Sesame seeds. <laughs> sesame seeds. What if he has like a thousand sesame eyes? Oh my God, that's terrifying. Okay. Oh, and maybe he's got like French fry legs. Oh my God. Oh, this burger's so hungry. How ironic would it be if he was a vegetarian? Oh, <laughs> he's got all these sharp teeth, but he's just like, I just want lettuce. If he ever becomes satisfied, he'll cease being hungry, burger. Burger. He'll just be regular burger. And then you know? no one can play with his card because he'll be powerless. I'm gonna give you a clue. A small Japanese flag can be seen on the top of this creature's bun. Got so it. So he's like a little Japanese boy. <laughs> yes, because all all little Japanese boys have <laughs> flags. Do you think they have like a little cocoon for their little babies? Oh, little sliders? <gasps> oh, that's adorable. Slider spiders. It spindles little condiments, so like mustard and ketchup and stuff. This looks great. I don't even want to look at the actual guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty happy with how this turned out. Wow. Oh my god, that's like pretty spot on. Yeah, I think I innovated on it. That's puberty stage for your hungry burger. I've got a Yu-Gi-Oh monster for you. Yay. Zork Necrophades, aka Zork the Dark One. I don't know what a Zork is. Would you like a clue to start off with? Yeah, let's do that. Clue one says, large, purple-skinned demon with bat-like wings. This is a pretty big villain in Yu-Gi-Oh, and he is jacked. He is jacked. He's a demon, so that makes me think he is a dragon. If he is jacked, he definitely went to the gym. Oh, there we go. There, yes. Jaden, yes. I don't know enough me, so I'll try my best. What do dragon nipples look like? Maybe just horns? <laughs> Aww. He said bat wings. Yeah, bat remember wings. remember that description. He skipped wing day. Again, there. <laughs> he skipped wing day. He's gonna get made fun of on all the demon lifting forums. I don't know how tail muscles work, but. It oh, yeah. It, it does yeah, not skip like, tail day. You know how bros are with their protein shakes. Oh, do I ever. They should call them protein shakes, am I right? I skipped ahead in the clues. You can't see this in the card, but he has a dragon head coming out of his stomach. Oh, that takes away the abs. <laughs> Aww, he's cute. Oh, but he's all also lifting. You can't skip stomach, stomach head, head day. day. <laughs> He doesn't skip wing day. I don't even know what beefy, muscly wings look like, so You got imagine. it. It's that. If the big one's name is Zork, the little one's name could be like Zerk. Zork and Zerk? They're buddies. They get along way better than the two heads on Miscellaneousaurus. Like, one thing that it, I wish I gave him was a tank top. Maybe just a real tiny one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it just, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, a, so, it's so small. His mom got it for him. It's obviously ripping. Oh, mom. I'm I'm not that small anymore. This is the biggest one they had at the store. <laughs> I 
I, let me like color them purple a little bit. I forgot that that was a detail. Wow. Oh my lord. The one we drew is like nowhere near as jacked. That's his body goals. All right, I think that's it. <laughs> we did Yu-Gi-Oh. No justice. <laughs> we did it. We did Yu-Gi-Oh perfectly. No one could be mad at what we've drawn. I know nothing about Yu-Gi-Oh, but I feel very informed <laughs> and educated now. If you liked this video, then you should go watch our Dark Souls video oh, yeah. with Nathan and Julie. It's like the same concept, but what would you call it? Um, I you know, it, it's it's just it's on a different channel. <laughs> I just realized this guy kind of looks like Spyro. <laughs> you drew jacked Spyro. Thank you for watching. Go watch Drawfee, and uh, that's it for right now. Bye. Bye.